I had this weird dream the other night where I don't know where the event was. It sort of felt like it was in a city like New York. It was somewhere where I was there and I, I don't know if I lost the heat or, or what. All I knew is that I had to get out of there. I had to just pick up and, and grab all my stuff and leave. And every time I went back to my locker, there was something more in my locker to, to clear out. You know, obviously there's boards and wetsuits, but then there was like suits and other luggage and just weird stuff that I would never take to the beach. In my dream, I wanted to sneak out and just disappear, but cameras just kept following me. I was just like, Oh, just go away, <laughs> you know. I don't know if that's how I subconsciously feel or what, but yeah, it just felt like I just had to get away from that scene. You go to other countries and you know, so you go to Indonesia or Hawaii, you always feel like a tourist because you don't have those deep-seated roots where here I feel like a sense of home in a way. That's my heritage. You know, my dad was born here. The closest family we have is pretty much from Ireland. So um, it's always been a place to go and you know, you always feel so welcome. I've been to Ireland a couple of times but I've never had waves. I was looking at charts and I just saw that there was so much swell coming to Ireland and um, yeah, just was like, all right, it's now or never really. So um, just sort of booked the ticket and jumped on a plane and here we are. <laughs> Being on tour, you're always focusing on the next day. Even if you, you lose your heat, it's like, all right, when am I getting home? How do I have to get my body right for you know, this event or that event? Do I book accommodation for there? And now I can go and actually stop. I can stop and have a moment and actually live today rather than, okay, what are we doing tomorrow? That was one thing that I learned. You can be here today and deal with tomorrow when it comes. I 
mean the goalposts have changed. But obviously world titles are incredible things. They're something you strive for as a little kid. And people always ask me, do you want to win more? And to be totally honest, couldn't care. I just The ones that I won were amazing and great to achieve something, but now it's not my biggest desire. I, I don't miss waking up every day and constant strive to be at 100% every morning you wake up. It's good to be able to okay, I feel like shit today, so I might chill. <laughs> or actually, I feel amazing today. I'm gonna go and do all these things.